staying a little bit high from these markers this time because I think I was feeling a little bit, uh... Take your top off. <laughs> I like weird. Yeah. A lot. It's perfect for this show. Yay! I am Natalie Kim. This is It's a Draw. I'm here with Keisha Zola, the actress and comedian. I'm so excited to be here. I don't care. I'm going to say it many, many times. Keisha's coming off uh, Orange is the New Black and also uh, Broad City. Broad City. We are very happy to have you Aww, here. Thank you. Keisha, because you are the guest, you get to choose the two word phrase. This one. Oh. Banana hammock. Yeah. Three, two, one, draw. I just saw on your Twitter that you met the president. What, what, what was that? I forget, like, that exists in my life, too. Oh. Um, <laughs> uh, basically, sometimes parents are weird. My mom bought one of those plates to meet Obama. It was at the 4040 Club, and I got to see Beyonce's butt, and that, for me, was as exciting as meeting the president, because it is as glorious as everyone thinks it should be. I love how we started off with Obama and ended up with Beyonce's butt. Yeah, well, you know, it's the journey of black culture. When I was three, I was so painfully shy. I like told my dad that. I was like, Dad, I think I want to be a comedian. And my dad laughed in my face because I was so shy. And I'd watch Sam Kinison, I'd watch Eddie Murphy on SNL, Rodney Dangerfield. So I remember watching all these like comedians who kind of didn't care, were a little brassy. Whoopi Goldberg too. And all that kind of shaped my sensibility. I have a solo show and I do another bit with a vibrator. Carving a niche, guys. <laughs> Do you, need, do you need someone to Get do something down. real gross with a vibrator? I loved what you said on the blog also about doing improv as a minority. Mm -hmm. Because I, I had felt it, but I never could articulate it the way you had done it. When we don't have the shared experience, it can be a little bit odd. Yet, when I watch you doing so well with the improv, you feel it's getting better, or it's rare that, that that happens? I think it is getting better, but like, like my desire is to empower people. Like, I was recently on a panel, and I was, they like did one of those wrap-up questions. They're like, whose career do you want? And it's very simple to me. I want to be Bob Odenkirk. And the reason I want to be Bob Odenkirk, he's done incredible things on his own as a performer, but he's also opened the door for crazy weird artists, and he's never stopped creating, and he keeps creating, and he's smart, and uh, his voice is unique. Keisha Zoller. I am um, very inspired to <laughs> show our beautiful, <laughs> beautiful drawings. Banana hammock. Take Keisha. your top off. <laughs> Thank you so much, Keisha. It was oh, such a time. pleasure. Mine is a banana and a hammock, and there's grass. That, those things are grass. Tufts. They're tufts of grass. It's. Um, in my mind, it's like uh, a plains. I don't know why I thought of the Simpsons bumblebee guy, the Spanish bumblebee dude in a banana hammock. This is Natalie Kim with Keisha Zoller. Uh, see us next week, and also please subscribe, comment, and like. Because Natalie's awesome. Thank you, Keisha. She is.